Okay, a quick video on this timer here. So um, it can work from either push button or the sensor, which is the two meter sensor. We'll start with push button. So I'll just we'll push it and it counts down and it's um, green for the primary countdown. Then when the uh, it's time to pull the rack up out of the tank, it'll go red and it'll count up the operators to push the button. And then you have your drip time, <clears throat> which is, and then at the end of the drip time, just a short notice and it's reset. Uh, so if we operate it instead from the, um, let's see, I'm just gonna, but there is a, a minimum range, I don't know what it is, a few inches, if you see, so you can't be too short with it. But anyway, same, same behavior, um, and I still have my hand in front of it here. So if I remove my hand, then it goes into the same uh, drip time, and um, I'm going to end the cycle. Now, the reason I'm taking this video is because there's a behavior I'm not sure of, and that is if, uh, let's see if I can get my hand in the, in the frame here. Okay, so now it detects my hand. Now, if my hand comes away too soon, then it's going to indicate that with the red light. So there's nothing in front of it now, and um, which could be okay. There's the drip time again, and, um, and it's just going to reset at the end of the drip time. So that is a brief overview.